What's up, Aquarius, and welcome to my channel. I hope all of you guys out there are doing well. So, Aquarius, this is going to be a love reading. We're going to pull some cards and see what messages Spirit has for you guys. I've already shuffled, meditated over your cards, and let's get into this reading, Aquarius. So, so far by these cards that I'm looking at, I feel like there is someone, Aquarius, that you possibly used to deal with. Or this is someone, you know, you are currently dealing with. And it was like you and this person, y'all shared a very strong attraction. I feel like you were attracted to this person, but this person was very much attracted to you, Aquarius, okay? And you and this person, y'all had a lot of good times together. You know, you shared a lot of good memories. So I feel like this person that you're dealing with, Aquarius, this person is reminiscing because we have, I want to feel that way again. So it was like the way that you made this person feel, Aquarius, it's like possibly they tried to feel that way with other people or they're just missing the way that you used to make them feel, okay? So I feel like something happened here between you and this person because it has this person, like, they want to reach out and talk to you, but this person is afraid to contact you. So you and this person maybe could have had a fight or a disagreement or the way that you ended things maybe was not the way that they wanted to or the way you wanted to. So, but it didn't end off in a good way is what I'm trying to say because it has this person afraid to contact you. This person doesn't know if you're going to reject them by meaning, you know, if they try to make some type of offer, if you're going to reject their offer, this person don't even know if you're going to answer the phone, if you're going to call them back. But this person is afraid to contact you. And so they're saying, you know, since they're not sure if you want to talk to them or if they can make things right, <coughs> excuse me, that they're just going to take this time and heal. So let's pull some more truth messages here and let's see what happened with you and this person in this connection. And we're going to see why this person is afraid to reach out. Okay, so let's pull some more truth, Oracle. What messages do you have for my Aquarius today, Spirit? Okay, this person lied to you. Okay, so now we're getting into it. So, for some of you, this person possibly lied to you. And that's why they're afraid to contact you. They're like, uh-uh, Aquarius going to cuss me up and down. And I ain't looking forward to their cussing, Aquarius, okay? But they just feel like you're not going to communicate with them at all. So... Let's continue pulling from this deck and see what's going on. What messages do you have for my Aquarius today, Spirit? But this person, they can't stop thinking about you, Aquarius. So this person, like I said, you're on their mind constantly. They at work, they think about you. They at home, they think about you. They dream about you. They talking to their family and friends about you. Like this person, I feel like they're really regretful for lying to you. Or whatever this person did, whether it was lying to you or... You know, whatever it was. I feel like for a lot of you guys, this person lied to you. And now they can't stop thinking about you. I will wait for a sign for you. So this person saying, okay, they, they understand that you don't want to talk to them. And they feel your energy that you don't want to talk to them. So they're just going to wait for some type of sign from the universe. Away from a sign from you saying, okay, it's okay to reach out to you at this time. So this person's waiting for you to give them some type of sign, some type of signal, some type of smoke signal, something. <laughs> Letting them know that it's okay to talk to you. And then we have, you came closer than anyone. So I feel like this person that you were dealing with, Aquarius, maybe this was someone who didn't like to be, like, vulnerable. Maybe they didn't like to be open with their feelings. Or maybe this was someone who, like, always um, felt the need to protect themselves. Or they had, um, what's the word I'm trying to use here? They were guarded. I'm thinking of the picture with the eight of swords. You know, it was like they 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 said boundaries. They had a wall up. Thank you, spirit. This person like had their wall up, and it was like you were the first person that, that got a peek over that wall. Everybody else, they don't get nothing but the wall action. But for you, you actually got a peek in that wall and got to see this person's true colors. So let's pull some messages through music, and then we're gonna pull a couple of cards here. We're gonna see what else is going on in this connection. What messages through music do you have for my Aquarius today, spirit? What messages to music do you have for my Aquarius today? Okay, messages to music for my Aquarius. Okay, so we have Ju Ju. <laughs> we have Joe. I want to do. So this person wants to do all the things that's going to make you feel good. Okay, they want to do everything that's going to make you make it right between you guys. And it talks about telling the truth or. Buying you flowers, whatever they feel they need to do to make things right. That's exactly what this person wants to do. What message do you have, my queries? Sorry for 2004, Ruben Stutter. So this person wants to apologize. Whatever they did, whether it was lying to you or whatever it is, this person is saying they are sorry, okay? They are sorry for lying to you. They're sorry for not telling you the whole truth. 
this person is very sorry, Aquarius. Let me get one more song here. Can I get one more song for my Aquarius kid? One more message to the music. Okay, and then we have 112, only you. This person wants to be with only you. So for some of you, this person possibly could have lied about maybe someone from their past or someone they were dealing with. Like, they made it seem like it really was nothing when it could have been. It may not have been nothing like that, but it was something. You know what I'm saying? So this person's saying they are sorry. Let me push these cards back, you guys. Hold on. Okay, I had to push the cards back. Okay, so let's pull some tarot here. Let's see what was going on between you and this person. So, Spirit, what did this person lie to my Aquarius about? Can you tell me what this person lied about, Spirit? Can you tell me what this person lied to my Aquarius about? I think I might need to get my other dick. What did this person lie about? Tell me more about this connection. Okay, so for some of you, this person did not want to change. So maybe this person told you that they were going to work on themselves and they were going to change. But this person did not want to share their old ways, okay? So for some of you, you could have known this person was like maybe a player that they never really had one person that they dealt with, okay? This could have been someone who dealt with various people. But it was like when you came along, it was something different about you, Aquarius. You made this person like want to settle down. And I feel like it kept you and this person in mental conflict. This could have been a fellow air sign that you were dealing with, um, Libra, Gemini, or Aquarius. But I feel like this transformation that this person had to go through, this change that this person had to make, I feel like it kept them in mental conflict. One, because they really didn't want to change, but this person knew that they had to change some of their ways in order to be with you, okay? I feel like for a lot of you guys, this person's throat chakra is opening up, so this could have been someone who in the past who didn't like communicate a lot of things with you guys, okay? It was like you had to figure out this person. It's like now this person, they're trying to transform. They want to be able to communicate more. They want to come out this mental conflict. They don't want to be in mental conflict anymore. They don't want you to be in mental conflict anymore. So this person, I, I feel like they feel bad for not being able to communicate with you maybe the way that you needed them to, okay? Then we have suffering and silence. So this person is suffering in silence. Like, so this is air energy here again. Some of you guys could be dealing with the fellow air sign. Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. But I feel like this person suffering in silence over your absence, okay? This person possibly tried to make everything seem like, you know, everything was fine. They were doing okay. But this person really does miss you. Okay, Aquarius, that's all I have for you guys. If something resonated, please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe.